Okay, you're gonna show you some serious health complications with the sin of interracial marriage. Interracial marriage is a perversion. It is unnatural, it is wicked, it is very grievous sin in the eyes of God. It's also very unhealthy and unscientific. And it just, overall, just is gross. And I'm not saying that because I hate other races. I'm saying that because I want to actually see other races being preserved. Okay? I'm not a racist. A racist is someone who thinks that their race is superior and others should be eliminated. I never said that. Okay? Separatism is not racism. Okay? Separatism says blacks stay in Africa, you know, uh, go where God intended them to go, whites in Europe, Arabs in Arabia, Persians in Persia, Indians in India. You know, what's wrong with that? It's how God intended it. Genesis 10, verses 1 to 5, and Genesis 10, verse 26 to 32, talk about how God divided the Gentile nations. It's not racism, it's what the Bible teaches. Okay? We're going to show you some serious health complications with this perversion known as interracial marriage. Okay? Because you have some professing Christians out there who are teaching this, pro this heresy that interracial marriage is okay. And because they can't handle the scriptures, because you show them scripture, they can't handle it. Let's see if they can handle science. So here's the first interesting fact. Did you know that uh, mixed race children are more likely to have health problems, high stress, smoke, and drinking problems? And keep in mind, this is from a government source. It's from .gov. It's a government source. It's not some right-wing fundamentalist website. It's from a government source. They're saying that these they're having health problems. Here's another fact. Mixed race kids suffer from low self-esteem, social, isol social isolation, and poor family dynamics. And again, from another government source. So I guess the uh, U.S. government, I guess they're a racist too, apparently, because they're stating these facts. Here's another interesting fact. Uh, mixed race couples are more likely to have stillborn babies than same race couples. And again, from another government source. And you want to tell me it's natural? I don't think so. And here's a last fact. Interracial marriages have a 23.5% 23 23 chance of divorce compared to 13% of same race couples. So, not only is there all kinds of health problems for the children, there's high rates of divorce too. Interracial marriage and racial miscegenation is unnatural, it's a perversion, it's unholy, it's unscientific, and it's unhealthy. And it's just overall wicked, it's a sin in the eyes of God. And science confirms that, because these professing, these heretics who think that interracial marriage is okay, because they can't handle the scriptures, hopefully they can handle science, because science is backing up what the scriptures say. So don't be deceived by all this pro-interracial marriage insanity. Let me just say this right now, the satanic agenda of interracial marriage and racial miscegenation will tie in to the Antichrist agenda. How is the Antichrist going to bring the whole world together? Through separation of races or through racial miscegenation and amalgamation? That's how he's going to do it. That's why I said that the agenda of interracial marriage is satanic and demonic. Because it will be used by the Antichrist to bring in the one world government prophesied in Revelation 13. So don't be deceived by all this pro-interracial marriage. And plus, too, if interracial marriage is is good in the eyes of God, why does the the you know liberal satanic Hollywood I call it Hollywood? Why does the anti-God Hollywood, the anti-God liberals, why do they promote it so much? Interesting. If it's if it's holy and good in the eyes of God, why do the liberals and the anti-God and the Satanists and the anti-God Hollywood? I'll say it that way. Anti-God Satanists over in Hollywood. Why do they promote it so much? Why do the Luciferians and the Illuminati and, and Hollywood promote it so much? Because it's not. It's not holy. It's anti-God. Interracial marriage. It's wicked. It's vile. It's disgusting. It's an abomination. So don't be deceived. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with all the brethren. Goodbye.